I'm very concerned to hear that the, the US uh, government's reaction to these leaks is to actually block their uh, military from uh, seeing the WikiLeaks sites and also basic websites like the Guardian website, the Der Spiegel, who've been reporting these WikiLeaks. Uh, it just smacks of absolute control freakery and this is the last thing you need in situations like this. I mean if the FBI and the Air Force are to do their job of course they need to know what's going out there to the rest of the world and this follows uh, from uh, a couple of weeks uh, ago when uh, the, it was announced that the FBI were going to be blocked from uh, accessing these WikiLeaks sites. This is really just disaster management of the worst kind and it, it shows a, a, an attitude of control freakery at the top. Now a lot of what's been going on with WikiLeaks of course is to do with power and trust between the people and governments. So uh, this is just going to make sure that people trust their governments and their senior people and their military even less. Uh, and it seems that this is sort of uh, moving away from some of the basic facts about the leaks to actually stopping uh, the Air Force uh, and the US military accessing the sites. This is one of the most crazy things I've ever heard. And of course, they will go home, they can access it from home. What is the point of what they're doing? And it's uh, uh, maybe, possibly, what we're seeing here is an attempt at a clamp down in the US anyway uh, on public and uh, other people's access to the internet, which is rather frightening. It, it starts to look like massive amounts of hypocrisy going on. Uh, how can the US criticise China, for example, for blocking access to the internet when it is blocking access uh, for its own uh, citizens, or at least for its military personnel, to uh, sites like WikiLeaks? Actually, it's not just WikiLeaks that they're trying to block here. It's all the other newspaper sites which have been reporting the leaks. Uh, I mean, what they're doing here is, is a kind of blanket form of mass censorship. So whereas the population in Britain and America can read the Guardian website, the military can't. It seems absolutely bizarre and totally hypocritical.